Hello again everyone and welcome back to Dragon Age Origins. We are, have returned here in Lord of the Ring and we're going to see if we can release this fine fellow here called Sten. I believe he's a prisoner. Uh, he might be a c companion by, by the sounds of things. That's a bandits over there? I'd, probably not, I don't know. Um, but yeah, we, it, might, it might be a companion, I'm not too sure. Uh, apparently we can go and release him. Or try and release him at least. Uh, he seemed content to remain in his prison. Really? Oh yeah, I I, I still need to find that guy, don't I? In this in this place, uh, who's abandoned his post? Oh no, uh, it's conscription, isn't it? Yes. <gasps> The deserters are in other places. Uh, so we need to go to the Chantry, I think? Yeah, I'm fairly sure the Chantry. Um, so tell uh, me something, Morrigan. Did you oh. live there in that forest your entire life? I left it on occasion, but I always returned. Why? Is that so strange? It was my home. But it was just you and your mother there. No one else. Mother occasionally had company. What? Company? Do I even want to ask? No, you really don't. Right, that sounds interesting. <laughs> Company. That's what they say. So uh, I think if we if we talk to the revered mother, is that what she's called? The revered mother. I think uh, she can possibly authorize a release since we can we, we can essentially conscript him, can't we? Yeah, the revered mother. Good day, Sister Liliana. I'm surprised to see you're still in Lothering. It is good to see you as well, Your Reverence. Is there something I can do for you then? What's our Sten? Uh oh, she's standing up. It might have been kinder to execute him, but I leave his fate to the Maker. Why does he interest you? What if this caused an incident with his people? The Maker demands justice, regardless of his race. Hmm. What did he do? He butchered an entire farmhold. Only one of the youngest hid long enough to survive. Jesus the Christ. The said his father had found the canary gravely wounded and took him in. That kindness was repaid with murder. Wow. The bandsman found the canary just standing amidst the carnage. He did not resist them. Are you certain he did it? He confessed quite readily, but would give no reason for the crime. Even the seasoned knights who apprehended him were disturbed by the carnage. However docile he appears, do not be fooled. That canary is a danger. Oh, uh, really? Is there I can convince you to release him? Then his next victims might count you and me as their murderers. I was thinking you might release him to my custody. And what do you say on this, Liliana? You know your friend better than I. These are unusual times, Your Reverence. With us, the Kunari might do some good. I am sure of it, in fact. Were things not so desperate? Very well, I trust you. Take these keys to his cage and ah. make her watch over you. Thank you, Your Reverence. Your trust is not misplaced. So we now have the case to Sen's cage, so we can actually go and release him. So we might actually have our um, fifth companion, I guess you could say, uh, counting the dog as one, of course. Uh, so that's not too bad. We'll head right over there and release him, since I don't think there's anything else pertinent I need to do in Lothering right now. Unless that guy that I need to find is actually here, which I'm not sure he is. I'm wondering, Morrigan, oh. do you believe in the Maker? Certainly not. I've no primitive fear of the moon, such that I must place my faith in tales so that I may sleep at night. But this can't all be an accident. Spirits, magic, all these wondrous things around us, both dark and light. You know these things exist. The fact of their existence does not presuppose an intelligent design by some absentee father figure. <laughs> so it is all random then. A happy coincidence that we are all here. Attempting to impose order over chaos is futile. Nature is, by its very nature, chaotic. I don't believe that. 
I believe we have a purpose. All of us. Yours, apparently, being to bother me. Calm down. No need to argue. There's better things we can be doing. Like arguing with Alistair. That always goes quite well, I feel. I've already explored that that little corner of this the, the Lothering, haven't I? Anyway, let's go to, let's go ahead and release Sten. I might have some decisions to make regarding, regarding my party with the amount of companions I'm getting here. Hello, Sten. You wish something more of me. I have the key to open your cage. I confess, I did not think the priestess would part with it. She agreed to release you uh, into my custody. So be it. Set me free and I will follow you against the Blight. How can you help us exactly? I have spent my life in the Vanguard. I know war. And your lands need all the help they can get. Tis true. Well, I'll let you out. And so it is done. I will follow you into battle. In doing so, I shall find my atonement. Thank you, Stan. Glad to have you with us. May we proceed. I am eager to be elsewhere. Okay. So we have found Sten. Uh, level 7 warrior. Right. Um, so, so do we go with rogue, mage, warrior? Or do we maybe swap one of these out? Obviously I have to be part of the party. Uh, do, we, do we take Alistair out? For Sten? I don't know. It's kind of it's kind of hard to decide this actually. I feel like I want one of each at least in the party. Obviously, I'm a warrior, so I guess I can take that. I don't know. Do, do I keep Sten? I don't know. Uh, if I take Alistair out, yes. put Sten in for the time being, and I'll, I'll have a conversation Why with him. Why are we stopping? He's quite tall. Christ alive! I think we should talk for a moment. There are dark spawn to be fought. Is this delay needful? I don't know if I can trust you at my back. I am Kunari. I have given my word to aid you. We are not people of idle promises. Never seen a Kunari before. So, uh, tell me about your people. No. Oh. No? Why not? People are not simple. They cannot be summarized that was... in reference in nope. a manner of... The elves are a lithe, pointy-eared people who excel at poverty. Uh, you said you're in the army? I am. Have you ever fought in a war? I have always fought in war, human. What do you mean by that? My people have been at war since the moment we set foot in the Northern Islands. I think this guy's sort of, uh, you know, hit first, ask questions later. So the canary don't come from the islands? We do now. Oh. Where'd you come from before? Somewhere else. Okay. Can you be more specific? No. Okay. I was born in Sahara. <laughs> the land we came from, I know nothing, not even its name. I do not see how this matters. Seheron and Parvolan are distant. Ferelden and the Darkspawn are immediate. Are you alright? You were in that cage for weeks. You are concerned. No need. I am fit enough to fight. Right. We should get moving. As you wish. Well, Stan approves at least. Anything else to talk yes. about? Uh, what were you doing in that cage? Sitting, as you observed. Right. Uh... It's not what I meant. It's what you asked. Okay. <laughs> you don't like me much, do you? Warden, if I truly disliked you, I would leave. That I am still here, you may interpret however you choose. Are you going to answer my question? I did. Parshera, was there anything else? <laughs> <laughs> I think I feel like I'm going to piss that off at this rate. I want to discuss something you mentioned. Speak, then. That's enough for now. Then I suggest we move on. I have a question. I am hardly surprised. <laughs> Why did you come to Ferelden? To answer a question. <laughs> what was the question? The Arishok asked, what is the blight? By his curiosity, I am now here. Do you have to report back then? Yes. Right. What are you still doing here then? I cannot go home. Why not? It doesn't matter now. Can we move on? We keep the dark spawn waiting. Let's go. As you wish. <laughs> what a fantastic conversation that was. <laughs> um, what's what's Sten's skills like anyway? He's a 
brute in strength, isn't he? Good God. Um, he really is a... It, he, he is definitely just, just the tank, isn't he? Uh... Yep, very much the tank. Does, it, does he have any equipment at all? No, he won't, will he? Well, you can use this dagger. Just guess it's slightly better. Uh, you can have all these bits of armor at least, too, I guess. Uh, yeah, might as well. Keep him, keep him well equipped. Hmm. What if I should use Sten or Alistair? Alistair seems like he'd be a better guy to have around, but Sten's Sten can act as a bit of a tank, essentially, for the for group, and just absorb punishment. Why is there a bunch of refugees out here? We don't know what was said. You're a warden. I don't know if you killed King Kalen, and make her forgive me. I don't care. But that bounty on your head could feed a lot of hungry bellies. Attack! Are you serious? What the f- You really had nothing better to do than attack me. Well, you made a horrible mistake anyway, I guarantee that. One thing I guarantee you made a bad mistake. A very bad mistake. There's actually quite a lot of them. Sten's dead. Holy hell. I did not see that coming at all. I really need to micromanage my party better, don't I? Oh boy. Well then. That was um eventful. Uh yeah. It's not a good idea to attack me. Maybe Sten tanked stanked a bit up. <laughs> stanked. Maybe Sten tanked a little bit too much. I actually have more health than him, don't I? Hmm. Maybe I should be the tank, I don't know. Uh I think I think we will actually get Alistair back for now. Vashadan. Yes. I quite like Alistair. I'll keep him in there. Um No one's injured. oh Alistair's injured. Damn. What? Didn't, didn't realise that. Alright, Morrigan, calm down. Uh use the lesser injury kit, there's no need to overdo that. Uh use there we go. Okay, so hopefully we don't get attacked by mob random. Honestly, right, all they had to do was ask me, and I, 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 I would have given them the value of the bounty probably. I can't it's imagine. Ah, uh, what is that now? Bandits! Oh God! I shall do. Best be wary. Oh! There's archers as well. Crap. Oh. 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 Crap, 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 crap. Let's make this quick. Down you go. Alright, that was it then. Alistair, you better you Uh crap. Uh I'm gonna make I'm gonna try and keep my party alive this time if I can. I'm being attacked by a goddamn Mabari, what the f I'm gonna heal again. I'm really gonna have to stay stocked up on uh on health pulses, aren't I? Oh crap, Liliana. Oh, I didn't realize the health was so low. 
Obviously, Liliana really probably shouldn't be the one taking all the punishment. It's not the greatest idea uh, in the world. There we go. Aye, 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 aye. So, so, so that's one group of bandits taken care of. Because you're a rogue, you shouldn't be upfront and personal with the bandits, really. Uh, anyway, Liliana, you're gonna need healing, aren't you? Uh, lesser injury kits. Yep. We sh we have plenty of money, so we should be able to buy plenty of health bolts to take care of all that jazz. Uh, why isn't Liliana getting getting a, ho a whole of her health back? Oh, there we go. All done. Um. What now? Is there more bandits? There is more bandits. I'll try and make sure all the attention is on me. Since I can deal with the punishment a little bit better than Liana. Not massively, but a little bit better. Health poultice. Alistair, you better you better drink a health poultice. Seriously now. There we go. Bash. We're flying in the fields now, holy hell. Right, so is that another bunch down? Okay, so that's the second group of three bandits down. Uh, I'd say we're doing quite well here. Why does Alistair apparently have no health forces? I I is it because they're in my inventory? Oh no, it's just because it's actually not left. Oh god, yeah, because I, I, ha I have him actually using the, the best ones available, don't I, I think. And I don't. Uh, self, health, below. Below 25%. No, uh, below 10%. Yeah. Use the most powerful health pool. This. There we go. Okay. Should be okay. Um, right, what now? It's probably the things we can find on the outskirts of Lothering. I'm not sure what exactly, but I'm sure we'll find something. There's always something to find. Oh, it's something to find in these games. Did I actually hear someone speaking? I'm sure I did. Could be wrong. Could be just going insane. Would not surprise me one little bit. Um. Oh, there's the other bandits. Done. We found them! Now we get our hands working. That bandit went down really quickly. That's good news. Oh, Alistair, come on. I think I might have to change that to 25%. Because he should not have went down there. Use the health pulse as well. Don't give them the advantage. What you say? I need another one actually. Holy hell, I'm, I'm taking a lot of arrows in the back, clearly. 
Right where my guard is down, you hit me in the back, I you dishonorable Sometimes. fools. Liliana! Crap. Uh, give her uh, just a regular health pull. Let's use. There we go. Won the day. Sorted. So that should be all three. It shall be done. Allow me. I could do that for you. Yeah, that should be all three. Um, all three bandit groups dead, thankfully. As far as I'm aware, anyway. Health pulses. We do need plenty of them at this rate. Less health pulses. As you say. Bandit leader, great sword. Can I think cap? Check all those bits of armor that we got. Oh, it's a lot better than mine. I will use that. Other boots, a little bit better than mine. Can't complain. Can I also wear those? No, I can't. Huh. Alistair also has an injury, don't he? Uh. We need to stop, stop letting people go down so much. Let's take take uh, take those skills off. They're really sapping my stamina. Um, so that is the exit exit uh, from Lothering. What's over here? Anything or nothing? A few more bits of el elf fruit. How many flasks do I have? Anything? Because I. Make a few less, lesser health pulses. No reason not to. What now? What the hell is going on there? Since I'm here, I may as well save. I'll I'll save over the most the earliest one. Giant spiders? Seriously? Of all the things, giant spiders. And they are really, really annoying me. Good god, oh, didn't mean to do that. Oh, the giant spies have toxin extracts. Well, I could have used, used that for my poison making, couldn't I? Hmm. Well, can't complain. Really didn't expect there to be giant spiders, though, to be honest. Uh. I hope the citizens of Lothering are aware of their giant spider infestation. I mean, you would have thought it would have been at the forefront of their attention, if anything. Say, like, oh, we've got about five... Well, it's, it's like five or six giant spiders j just on our outskirts, as well as the bandits. They could probably cause a bit of damage. That'd be fine. Whatever. Who cares? Um, so if we go and just turn this quest for the to kill the bandits... It was the Chanter board, wasn't it, I think? The Ch Chanter's board? I believe... I don't need shield defense anymore, I don't know why they're still enabled. I need to find... I need to find that guy who, need, who needs to be conscripted as well, actually. I'd wager all these elves are working with the dark skin. Can't really find where he is. I would have thought he would have been standing around somewhere. Doing absolutely nothing, but uh, obviously not. Blessed are the peacekeepers, champions of the just. Three sovereigns, wonderful. Oh, another quest, apparently. When bears attack. Uh. 
They find the family of bears that mauled and killed the boy Eneth, for they are an abomination in the maker's sight, and their hides will prove great comfort to the northern farms and source for Fed's family. As a chance of ordering, I do pledge a sum of one sovereign to whoever carries out this, the maker's will. Exercise caution, and foremost, may his life bear the soul. So he's going to kill a bear. Ask. Thanks for all the village who opened their vans and crossed the rest in the dark. Uh, there's a lone boy in the village whose mother, uh, good wife Sarah, is missing. And she's been missing for the better part of a week as, as of this writing. She's presumed dead. Uh, may the maker bless her passing. She was a lady of middle years with red hair and fond of a green cloak. If any traveller or resident comes across her in the wilds, please return her body or the effects on her remains. In later years, the boy will be thankful to have such keepsakes to remember her, his, his brave mother by. The officer of the chance will compensate this kindness with some of fifty silvers. May the maker turn his gaze on us all. Fantastic. Well, not fantastic because there's a dead girl, but you know, it. I can help them out, I guess. Anyway, let me have a quick look around the refugee camp because I need I need to find where the hell that that uh, conscription guys. Well, the, the guy that I need to conscript to the, uh, what, what are they called? The Blackstone Irregulars, that's right. Has anyone walked over to where the bandits uh, were that I killed? Maybe? I, I don't know why they'd be hanging around there, but you never know. It was a crate here that I didn't, that I didn't notice. Trap triggers and iron rings. No, nothing on there. Fair enough. Um, I don't know where he could be. Patter Gritch in Lothering. That is strange. You don't look like the other folk fleeing the south. Were you in the battle? What makes you think that? You don't look chastened, so you're not from the wilds. And you're not a farmer. I'd guess you saw some fighting. Yes, I was with the King's army. I thought them that survived already marched north with the Tairn. You must be a survivor, or a deserter. Lucky you, I guess. I have some questions. Can't promise I'm gonna answer them. What's going on here? What isn't? We got chastened barbarians in every farmholder south of Kalanhard running from the Darkspawn. Not that they'll be safe here with the army gone. Who's in charge of this village? You could talk to the Elder. Though she's got her hands full getting everyone on their way. I can imagine. For now, most folks go to Sir Bryant. He's head of the Chantry's Templars. Mm -hmm. You don't have a ruling lord? He's gone to war and taken all his soldiers, leaving us to fend for ourselves. There's not going to be much left when he returns. If he returns. Probably not going to return, to be honest. Was Bannett always outside the village? Were? You mean they're gone? Uh, yes, I drove them well, off. goody for you. Now there's no one to drive off the blighted refugees. Sir Brian's would be glad, though. He's been talking about offering a reward for anyone who'd run them out. I should go. Don't let me stop you. Sir Brian's offering a reward as well. Maybe I'll have to go and have a word with him. I can't say no to a reward. You freed that creature from its cage. Do you honestly think we need more killers on the loose? Uh, well... I'll have you know, I'm quite good at keeping people under control. So if you want to just shut up, very much appreciated. Uh, d does Sir Brian's actually offer a reward for those bandits? Greetings, Grey Warden. What can I do for you? Nothing. Travel safely. I did already get a reward, but you. I thought I would be getting a double reward. Who knows? Unless it was the highwayman that we was talking about there. Maybe. I don't know. Well, I can't seem to find that guy uh, who... Make active. Is it... Oh, hang on a minute. Uh... Well, there's two quests. 
There's two quests up on the north again. Obviously, I need to kill the bear. I need to see if I can find that so woman's corpse. You truly do oh, not hang believe on. in any sort of higher power? It has been bothering you, I see. No, I do not. Must I? What do you believe happens to you after you die, then? Nothing? I do not go to sit by the Maker's side, if that's what you mean. <laughs> Only those who are worthy are brought to the Maker's side. So many other sad souls are left to wander in the void, hopeless and forever lost. And what evidence of this have you? <laughs> I see only spirits. No wandering ghosts of wicked disbelievers. It must be so sad to look forward to nothing. To feel no love and seek no reward in the afterlife. Yes, the anguish tears at me so. <laughs> you have seen through me to my sad, sad core. Now you're simply mocking me. You notice. It appears your perceptive powers know no bounds. Morrigans are really sacky, <laughs> sacky bitches and shit. Anyway, I think in the next episode we shall go and deal with those other two chance requests and we'll also maybe venture north, a little bit far on the north outside of Wuthering, hopefully get some of the stuff done. Uh, and we'll see what we do, yeah. So thanks, for, thanks a lot for watching, guys. Do hope you've enjoyed, and I will catch you in the next episode of Dragon Age Origins. Thanks again, guys. Have a nice day. Bye bye.